began. We have not missed a day. And here we go with another one. So we're just kind of loosening it up. This is Michael Franti. And it's a song called Flower. And it's about, uh, yeah, what's going on in the world. Here we go.
doing things with my arms because Brenda's mother is here from Pennsylvania doing our class seated, which is fantastic. So I'll make sure that we have some interesting things going on for you. All right, let's, uh, this next one is a kind of a, kind of a COVID reminder what to do song. It's called Inside and, uh, yeah, it's a little bit of Bee Gees takeoff, but let's get in a, a kind of a groove it's called Staying Inside. Here we go. Thanksgiving, these folks in the Gulf State are still cleaning up, cleaning up after these hurricanes, and especially 
Central America, Nicaragua, Honduras, all through that area. Two huge, huge devastating hurricanes in a row. So this time of year when we are just kind of figuring out who to celebrate with, they're still cleaning up. So let's give a little shout out to the South. It's a little bit of Cajun, a little bit of Zydeco. And the tune is called at, Down at the Twist and Shout. Down at the Twist and Shout with Mary Carpenter. Here we go. class well we had a little bit of a yeah a little bit of Freddie Mercury tribute because um, yeah it was the anniversary of his death in 1991 and so we did some nice queen tunes yesterday and uh, today we'll do one more we'll do a little bit of crazy little thing called love and you know Freddie wrote this uh it took him about 10 minutes I think he wrote it in his bathtub and um and then it became a worldwide hit so we're gonna go like this we're gonna go one a two a three and four five six seven eight over the top and over the top and over the top and all the way up with one two three four five six seven eight down up down up like that or whatever you feel like so as always you know do whatever you feel like to this music you can follow me or completely do something else but the main thing is engage your core lift up your ribs like some fabulous person is lifting you up from the back with their thumbs in your and your ribs lifting you up so that you are weightless weightless all right so let's have a little bit of freddie right here freddie mercury 
brought joy to people all over the world and is still doing an unbelievable, unbelievable force, force of nature. Here we go. <clears throat> solstice with us last year we did queen all the way up state street we danced our heads off and did all the all the queen hits and that was a ecstatic fantastic experience to have together Jeffrey, i'd love to do a kind of drop down a little bit and, and do our little um my rwanda that's a little salsa we've got so fabulous news from rwanda this morning we were able to send what yet another food relief to the southwest which is really hard to get to it's on the burundi and and congo borders there which is a militarized zone plus deep inside uh, Con uh, covid a lot of covid there so our team cannot get there we were able to raise money send money to to a kukabu and abakundana our pygmy our twa koa so the fish farmers and the seamstresses who were out of food entirely we were able to get food there in the last few days and i talked to justin our our Rwanda director this morning on WhatsApp, and he said the, the photos that he went to great lengths to get for you so that you can see the food being delivered were sent on a USB drive on a stick, and that stick got was put on a bus, and that bus took it to Chigali so that you could see these photos. So it's incredible, and also that we now, out of the 101 new students that we're trying to get sponsored, in addition to the 200 students we're sending to school this year, uh, high school and college, um, we have 100 new students to sponsor, and as of now, we have 37, which is extraordinary. In the last week, many of you have stepped up to sponsor students. So let's do a little bit of salsa. It's kind of a, yeah, it's an African beat, and this is from Rwanda, and they're talking about my peaceful country, my peaceful country. All right, here we go. A little bit of back and together. Well, I'm sorry, a little bit of review on salsa, a little back and together, and forward and together, and back and together, then left together and right, together and left, together and right, and take it side, side and together. Step side, together, side, together, like that. Open up your arms and open your whole back. Open up your whole body, your whole shoulder joint, all through your back, like that, then take it back, two, three, just to keep the beat, all right? So this goes out to our team in Rwanda. Fantastic job. Justin from Rwanda will be in class tomorrow for Thanksgiving, because he knows it's an important day for, for us Americans, and here we go. Oh, 
involved now because we these 12,000 people that we're working with in Rwanda 12,000 people that we know and we feel family with and we're in communication I am with the team every single day starting at six in the morning and and uh, yeah it's very exciting to be part of people's lives and uh, glad you can all be part of this with us all right let's do a little bit of um oh my god there's so much to do you know there's um uh, the biggest hotspot in the world right now, one of them is Ethiopia in Africa. And uh, I looked long, long and hard last night to find a song from Ethiopia. A lot of it is a little bit, the rhythms are a little bit tricky for Zoom, for to translate on Zoom. So I found this one, it's a, it's a very popular singer in Ethiopia, Ayu Gurma. It's a woman, Ayu Gurma. And this is, um, this is a song, it's Shebelalem, Shebelalem. It's a very unusual language. There's many languages in Ethiopia, but but uh, nothing related to anything we know. So really quite exotic and quite beautiful. So I got a little 12 8 rhythm going on here. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, bum, ba dum, ba dum. So just let go and relax and kind of feel. I mean, we got it made in the shade here right now with our lives here and what's going on in these. Uh, brutalized and conflict-ridden places in the world. We can at least feel that we know what's going on and we're fellow human beings just like them and uh, feeling with our heart and soul what's going on in these other countries and right now, Ethiopia. Here we go. Has suffered so much. <laughs>
now, uh, it is, uh, the month is Heritage Month for Indigenous Peoples in America, for Native Americans. So we've been celebrating every day with some music from the Indigenous Peoples community, from all different tribes, and today let us, uh, let us go with a little bit of um, this Thunderbirds Raised Her is the name of the group, Thunderbirds Raised Her. And the song is uh, Hear My Voice, and it's from, uh, yeah, the northwest of America, those tribes up there. So it's a group of people, and it's Hear My Voice. So let us, uh, let us just feel that group, you know, the kind of, as if we were in a powwow with step and touch and step and touch, and it's an extraordinary, those of you who've been to one of those gatherings, I got to be there in my youth, and you know, there's nothing quite like that communal feeling of all dancing the entire community together. So, so let us go with our, with our indigenous peoples in America, the people who were here, the people who were here. Here we go. on going in your body and in your mind. You bring out the river in me. That's what I feel like in this class. I think we're all bringing out the river in all of us, in all the rest of us. Just bringing out the life forces, forgetting about all the stuff, you know, all the stuff, just letting it go and, and breathing in that life force and just, uh, just being glad and being grateful that we're on this planet. We got to be on this planet, you know, on earth for a little bit of time, a little speck of little speck of time on a little speck of cosmic dust and here we are in out get in and gone but 
but it's fabulous to be able to share this human experience, this amazing, miraculous little experience we have with each other. Unbelievable. All right, let's uh, get into our Jerusalem. So I hope you all saw that. You all saw the latest. I mean, there's only a hundred thousand uh, entries from all over the world. So this is the most worldwide dance craze I have ever experienced in my lifetime. I'm sure. I it's just incredible. And this latest is two guys. I don't know where they're from in Africa, but they're two African dads, very hip, cool African dads, with their babies in their buggies, and they're doing Jerusalem, and also in their in their carry carry packs. They're doing oh my, and they can and they got some moves. Yeah, so uh, check it out. I sent that in an email to everybody last night. So um, here's the dance that we've been working on for those brand new to us. Here's, here's how it goes. It goes one, two, three, then one, two, three. So you're just touching your foot three times, no big deal. But if you want to add the hips, two, three, and hips, two, three. If you want to kind of do a little hip lift like that, fine, or front, or round and about, or nothing, whatever you feel like doing three and three, and then we just do singles. So we start with this, one, two, three, and one, two, now singles, we go one and one, all right? Nothing to it, easy peasy. And then we're gonna go forward, and everything on this dance, in this dance, starts with what foot? The left foot, right. Left foot is gonna walk forward. One, two, three, four. All right, so let's put it all together, we got one, two, three, and one, two, now singles. We got one, we got one, we got walk, two, three, four. I'm doing this quickly because most people have learned this by now. So now we go left, we just kind of go touch, walk, walk, walk. We kind of go touch, step, behind, and. Try it again, touch, step, behind, and. So Brenda's mom, if you're doing this with your arms, you try to do these steps with your arms, that's a good, that's a good thing. Let's see how we do that. We go touch, step. Now backwards, we go touch, walk, walk, walk. And then we just kind of hang out, a little bit of touching to the side to get up with the music like that. So that's the whole dance. Let's try it again. It just goes triplet and three, then singles, one and one, then walk, one, two, three, four. To the left, we go touch, walk, walk, back, touch, walk, walk, take it to the side, and side, and side, and side. And then if you want, if you're in the trickier move group, if you want to do the tricky move, then instead of those single touches, you know what I'm saying? After the three, instead of the single touches, you're going to go left, right, left, right. So just four kicks, starting with which foot? That's right, the left foot. One, two, three, four and one. So that's the trick of it. You got to do that extra step on the right to get going on the left. Let's try the scissors. So if I go like that, it means I'm doing my scissor steps. One, two, three, four, and one. Again, one, two, three, four, and one. One more time. One, two, three, four, and one, like that. But if you don't want to do that, just kind of hang with the Hang with the basic and like that. So we're gonna start with a little bit slower tempo. We're gonna start with a tune from Nigeria. And this is Yemi Alade. And we love this tune and it's another winner. And it'll get us warmed up for the real thing. Here we go.
exposed to the real thing. So this is the dance being done seriously all over the world. When we told Rwanda, when we told our team about it, they went, yeah, we're all doing it already. <laughs> so we were like, we were super late to the party. But we're going to share our, our Zoom version. So Genevieve, do a little bit more filming. Anybody who's smiling and whatever they're doing with their body, if they're smiling and enjoying it, then give us a little bit of footage there so we can share with the world, because why not? I love seeing what Genevieve filmed because so many of you were just making up your own stuff and it was perfect. It was just great. So just relax and enjoy. Enjoy this worldwide little tune for, I don't know, it just kind of happened. Here we go. and putting it on YouTube, they're doing it with plates of food, even in Africa, that where it came from, South Africa. Some of the kids are dancing with plates of food. I know, this is a fabulous persimmon from Marsha Warwick, or one of our dancers, biggest persimmon I ever saw. And that was our little umbrella from Brazil, from Sula, from uh, Northeastern Brazil, Recife, that umbrella. <laughs> All righty, so we got still a little bit of time. Uh, Let's do a little bit of get happy. Let's do a little bit of Judy Garland, just kind of to, kind of calm down and kind of just feel the groove and kind of get real and uh, yeah, get with that, get with that feeling of just get happy because you're only here once and life is short. So yeah, let's do it. Here we go.
the summertime. And if you haven't seen that movie lately with Gene Kelly and Judy Garland, you gotta see that movie again. It's a, they're said that number is completely spectacular. It is, it is a beauty. It is a thing of beauty. Yeah, that that song right there. So um, let's do this. Is gonna it's gonna really flip your wig here. This is that tune from uh, Kyrgyzstan. So another country that's gone through hell and on the, on the border with China and really uh, difficult um, in, in Central Asia, really difficult political scene there also in Kyrgyzstan, but, but this fabulous old dance that has been resurrected. It's an old traditional dance of, um, of horse riders and it's called Black, Black Stallion is what the name of the dance means. Um, Kara Gorgo, Kara Gorgo, Black Horse. And so we do these big, so here's what you do. So it's just these big steps, nice big deep step, like a horse rider, a horse person. Down and down and down and down. So stomach in, chest up really tall and here and here and strong and deep. Just walk and walk and walk and walk. And then they go like this when they're walking, they do this thing with their shoulders, bah, 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 bah. and then they have fists and this, and this, and this, and this, and flat hands like this. So you're gonna improvise, you're gonna do whatever you want. You just walk into the beat. You're going walk and walk with a flat hand like this, or a fist like this, or shoulders like this, like this, 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 okay? And then that little step we just did, Charleston, little bit of step with Judy Garland, same thing. Don't get them confused. We're just gonna go forward and back and forward and back and forward and like that. And a little bit of lifting up together, but you do whatever you feel like. This is Black Stallion from Kyrgyzstan. Here we go. without a dance from Kyrgyzstan. You know what I'm saying? Like yesterday we started class with Bohemian Rhapsody and we were saying like, you know, what other class in the world is starting class with Bohemian Rhapsody? Not too many, all right. So we're magically and unbelievably out of time again. I don't know how it happens, but um, here's, a, 
here's a lovely cool down tune just to get you in the mood for Thanksgiving. Just a, it's called River Falls. It's a really pretty tune. It's a little bit of a waltz. So just take yourself around your house and you know let go, let the music just move your body and soul. And with big gratitude that you're still vertical and moving around and alive and all these miracles are happening in your body every moment and you get to witness the whole thing. So yeah, let's just kind of kind of relax together. Here we go. to say that song makes me cry and you know so it's a great it's great trouble to be an American and very difficult and crazy but it is also a great privilege and a great joy and, and those deep cultural roots we have we all have them a little differently but things like Thanksgiving you know they bring us together in some cultural heartland inside our hearts and in a shared way you know whether you're alone or with family or whatever but uh but those songs, isn't it incredible? They can, they can take us there. I highly recommend if you need some watching during Thanksgiving, you just take any Ken Burns documentary, Roosevelt, Dust Bowl, Civil War, Jazz, the most phenomenal films ever made about our country and just go there and just stay there and it's a beauty and it's, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take your soul with it. All right, let's do our little balance, kind of relax and enjoy. I don't know if Lance is still with us, but thank you, Lance Orozco from KCLU, our favorite radio station, which offers us NPR in Santa Barbara. I listen to it online as well as in the kitchen or wherever I am on my phone. First thing in the morning, it's five, six o'clock, I just turn on KCLU and listen to Lance or listen to the NPR broadcast. And that's how we know what's going on in the world and in our little town here. So. Thank you, Lance, for your many, many years of, of uh, giving us, giving us our, our place, our town, and our news, and, and being so phenomenal, and uh, having such a high level of excellence in everything you do. Uh, I'm one of your biggest fans, as you know, and anyway, so everyone, I encourage you to get your news that way. It's, it's, quite, it's quite fantastic. All right, so everybody, engage your core here, lift up your chest, open up your shoulders, big, big breath. So now it's just that big celebration that you get to be on the earth and you get to be alive. And furthermore, you have this symmetrical body, kind of, for the most part. You got these hips and these ribs and these shoulders and you can kind of lift it all up and you can use all those wonderful joints, that gorgeous ball and socket joint you got in your hip there and 
beautiful shoulder joints and those ribs so finely articulated. I mean, it's pretty much of a trip, right? Pretty much exciting just to think, wow, right? Okay, let's do it. Here we go, Tiffany. Dance of the imagination. breath together into the day, into the light. Drink it up, all the positive energy, and let everything else just go. Alrighty, thank you everybody. Let's do our floor work. Don't go anywhere. Don't you dare go somewhere else unless you have to. Bring your blanket, something soft and cozy and delightful to give yourself some opening, relaxing, stretching, meditating, feeling big, huge gratitude for life as we do every day in class. And then tomorrow is everybody doing it at the same time, which is fun and cool. And yeah, why not? So everybody just take a load off, lay, lay on your back, take your knees up. Alrighty, let's see if we have help today from Chanchita. Come on, Chanchita. Alright, here we go. So just relax entirely everything and just take great joy in having a human body, you know, having a being a life form that is a sentient being that can feel stuff and experience stuff. And I mean, how cool is that? Plus, there's cats and they're so furry and fun and they take part in floor work, which is really kind of them, and, you know, to defer to us once in a while. Yeah, so take those knees both down to one side when you get, get in the mood down there, and let them soak into the earth and let the gravity kind of just hug your knees, and if you want to cross them out and kind of really, really sink down and pull in your stomach so you're protecting your your back there and then take a huge breath all the way through your lungs all the way up and then bigger and bigger expanding your lungs expanding your body taking great joy in the breath that you have and then letting everything just go slowly out 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 all righty
All righty, and if you want to kind of massage, give yourself a little self-massage because this is our big spa moment here, because why not? We totally deserve it. Everybody just give that tail that used to be a real tail, give what's left of it a nice massage and feel your way through your glutes there into your hips and through your tail and down the other side, right, and then cross those legs and just kind of let it all fall into the earth there really deep. Take a huge breath. So you guys can just focus. I have to multitask with my cat the whole time. Anyway, take that big, huge breath, opening up your lungs beyond. All right, and bring that all together. Put your feet down and kind of bring it up, bring it down a little bit here. And Pull in your stomach really tight, pull in that core, feel all those mysterious, wonderful muscles that are down there. And once again, it doesn't really matter all this stuff on top. We all have a different amount of stuff on top, whatever. We're talking about the deep, deep muscles that are protecting your lower back. That's what we're focused on. Bring in your waist a little bit of a quarter of an inch. Just use your own muscles as if you had a corset or a beautiful sash or something or somebody, maybe a cool person. Hey, yeah, that's a good idea. Like a cool, cool person pulling in your waist. Now that has to be just the right person. So I give you a moment to think about that. I already have three people in mind, but it's up to you. Bring in that waist really tight, really engage those core muscles. It doesn't have to be your husband or wife. I'm just saying, all right, so let your legs move a little bit so you can work that core, work those deep core muscles. Just kind of kind of bring it up and relax your neck and your shoulders because believe me, they are not going to be lifting your legs even though you can think they are. So just use all the strength in your core to make all this happen. Just stabilize your body while your legs are moving and then take a long big bicycle ride. Open it up. Open it up, really stretch your legs and take that bicycle somewhere wonderful in the world. It can be anywhere, somewhere tropical, somewhere like a lovely little forest road, a meadow, Sweden. I seem to always bring Sweden every day into this mix. And stretch it out, get your feet working, get your ankles working and your arches and your toes and stretch out your toes. All the while, your core is totally engaged, right? Uh-huh. A few kegels while you're at it, girls. Some long kegels, everybody. Kind of kind of work those muscles down there and really stretch it out. And when you're ready, let one leg take it all the way out in the opposite arm. And cat must adjust to which arm it is. All the way, stretch out your body from top to stern, from tips of your fingers to tips of your toes while engaging your core all the way. Other leg, stretch it on out, relax. Relax your back if you can. Your back is neutral. Your core is the thing holding on. Get that core a little bit stronger every day. That's what we're doing. Just easy and nice without straining your back. All righty, bring your knees in and relax and give your lower back a big hug because nobody else is gonna hug it right now. So give your lower back some love, 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 love. Put your feet down and bring up those knees all the way. I mean those hips, bring up the hips, the hips, the hips. Squeeze those glutes right there, really squeeze them tight and bring it up a little more. And if you wanna kinda, if your cat's not in the way, kinda, excuse me, hello. Stretch out your, oh my God, cat sitting on hands. This is a new one. So bring it all up, <laughs> oh, Jesus. And then take it down slowly, squeezing your muscles all the way, those glutes, and then relax the whole kitten caboodle. Kitten caboodle, you guys know that? Kitten caboodle, like kitten caboodle. And bring it all the way up, top, 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 those hips. Really tall, stretch out your whole kitten caboodle, your whole body. I have cat on hands, it's so strange. And down, 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 and let it go. Relax at the bottom. 
And then as you come up, squeeze those glutes, squeeze them up, squeeze them up, squeeze them up to the top. Thank you, Amy Cluck, our physical therapist, for giving us minute instructions about all these exercises we can do, hopefully that are safe for everybody, no matter what kind of shape your body's in. Thank you, Amy. I think of it every day as we do these. And all the way up and up and up and up. And down and down and down and down and down. And also Ruth Albert, who is a fabulous teacher of body movement. If you want someone working one-on-one -on -one with your body, we've got lovely world dancers who will help you one-on-one -on, -one on Zoom. Amy Cluck, who's our physical therapist, Linda Jalaba, also physical therapist, and Ruth Albert, who, who does beautiful uh, foam core work and Pilates and combos that can really help you get into a new place with your body like that. All right, let's grab your scarf or belt or kitchen towel or whatever you feel like or something else and kind of just uh, hook it there. And today for a little bit of music, we've got um yeah, James Taylor, Big JT on Country Roads, kind of a, getting us in the mood for Thanksgiving and the chance to all be grateful at exactly the same day. <laughs> I mean, we're grateful, super grateful every day, but it's fun to do it with the rest of the country. Why not? All right, thanks, Genevieve. Here we go. Just super loosen up and relax. Let everything go. on your knee open up your lower back this is crucial and important and lovely do it Open your 
back a little bit. a little bit. all together. Big breath into the day, into the light. I could have sat there all day. Thank you, thank you, Zora. Thanks, everybody, for being together today. 250 classes in a row, and many of you were at almost all the classes, so that's fantastic. And different music every day, and different countries, and different vibe, and different things to celebrate, and different things to mourn, and uh, people we have lost, and situations in our country that were almost unbearable, but hanging in there together and experiencing, witnessing, not alone by ourselves, but together is has been uh, an extraordinary gift. Thank you, everybody, for, for making it happen. And uh, today's Wednesday. Tomorrow's like, I don't know, Thursday and sort of Thanksgiving. So, yes, class as usual. Bring your family. Bring the kids. Bring the, bring the everybody's. Uh, to be in class and just kind of have a special little Thanksgiving party in class tomorrow. Okay, here we go. Thank you, Jeremy. Thank you. Thank you. I'm waiting for all of you. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Hope to see you Happy tomorrow. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Thanks, Jessica. Thanks, everybody, for being with us today. Love you so much. Bye-bye. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.